guys. I'm continuing with the different hot topics that you guys are struggling with and need answers to. So today's hot topic is what to do whenever you plateau on the keto diet. I myself plateaued. I gained about 15 pounds while I was in anesthesia school and the first five to six came off almost effortlessly. But then for about a month I plateaued and I thought there has to be a way where I can kind of tinker with what I'm already doing. So without adding any additional exercise, without changing any more of my diet, I didn't need to make any more dietary restrictions. I just needed to adjust how I was doing what I was already doing. So I added in fasting cardio. So fasting cardio is a great way for you to expedite your results or go ahead and start seeing results again. You don't have to do any more exercise. You're just changing the time that you do the exercise and how you're doing it. So for those of you who are not familiar with fasting cardio, that means first thing in the morning, you wake up and you do your cardio on an empty stomach. If you can do this two times a week, you're gonna burn 20% more fat. That is backed up by research, you guys. So I simply wake up, have coffee, go, get my workout in, 30 to 50 minutes max. You don't wanna do too long because then you risk burning the actual muscle mass that you have. You've gotta consider your muscles have fat in them also. So you don't want your body to start going into that for its fat source. So too much can actually be detrimental to your results or at least maintaining your muscle mass. My recommendation is high intensity interval training, HIIT training. That way you're spiking your heart rate and you're bringing it down. That's a great way to make your body target the fats and not target your proteins, which is where your muscles are, and also not target the fats that are in your muscles. If you do this two times a week, like I said, you should be able to see a lot of results. I did it and within two weeks lost an additional six pounds, basically bringing me back down to where I wanted to be and losing all of the 15 pounds that I gained during that program. I would love to help you guys with other tips for how to address the plateau that you're going to eventually see whenever you're on a diet, any diet and what type of adjustments you can make to get continued results or to optimize the results that you're getting. So like me, follow, comment, DM. I'd love to know what other hot topics you'd like to have addressed or what other questions you have about this topic in, in particular. And I will give you guys some other tips such as, such as getting rid of the sugar alcohols in my sugar video that I'm going to post in the future. I'm going to talk all about the sugars that you should avoid, the sugars that are good, and also the kind of hidden dangers of sugar alcohols that most people are unfamiliar with that can definitely make you plateau in your weight loss. So, all right, look forward to helping you guys out.